Hey everyone, it's time for Macro Minute Monday. This week's macro is called Bulk Slide Update. It lets you quickly add, delete, rename, reorder, or make other slide updates in bulk. Why use this? Because it's a quick and easy way to do things in bulk in one bulk step that you can't otherwise do in PowerPoint other than one at a time. And that can take a lot of time. When you run this macro, the Bulk Slide Update macro, a setting sheet will be created. Now, It'll look like this and it will list out all the slides in the PowerPoint file you designate and their existing values. So it makes it really easy to just tweak the ones you want. You know, the number of, uh, whether it's hidden or not, the transition effect, how long that's for, add or delete it, rename the file, which is often helpful for other macros within the add-in. So we've updated these few key points in the these settings within the different slides here. We've renamed them and, and changed the transition effect and some of those things. And once you run it after that, it will take that PowerPoint file, it'll update it. So the main things to see here, these last three slides were hidden where they, they previously were shown. There's a lot of other effects that you just can't really see in a screenshot, but they got updated in bulk, in one bulk step. Now you might be thinking that's kind of crazy to use Excel to make PowerPoint changes, but why not? You've got a list, and especially when you're gonna repetitively change things, why not? It just makes it easier. I previously managed a large PowerPoint file with dozens of slides, and this made it so much easier to reorder things, hide things based on conditionals in Excel, you know, that so you can make sure they happen right. That's it for this week. Please like, comment, repost, follow us, and see the link below to try this out for yourself. Thanks, and have a great day.